it's they can be deadly. Um, it's a bacteria that gets in. Um, usually they check for, well, have you had an open wound because there's stuff on your skin. Um, and so usually if there's an open wound, that's how it can creep in. Um, but it can come other ways like it did with me. Um, it's just a bacteria that grows um, and in severe cases, if untreated, it can kill you because it's slowly attacking everything in your body. And it's just, it's growing and spreading and killing all your important cells. Um, that's as far as I know about it. Um, I noticed that prior to the surgery, um, I had a hard time closing my hands. I was losing um, your basic functions within the body. And as soon as the surgery um, was over with, I got full function back in my arm. So from that, I knew that the staff was slowly shutting down my body because of how long it could have possibly have been in there. Nobody knows how long it was in there. Um, they said it's not impossible that it had been you know, this 11 years, but it's also um, more likely it could have been from my methotrexate remicade um, medicines that did it. It shuts down your, those meds shut down your immune system so much that you pick up these bacterias without knowing it and can cause this infection to go inside your body. So it was a little scary that it was inside the bone unnoticed. It didn't show up on any blood work, which is, it's tricky. And staphs are very hard to treat. Um, and so it was a six weeks pick line antibiotic 24 seven to make sure it was completely out of my system. And they don't know for sure if it is. They can't find anything, but they're confident enough that it's gone, but I'm not better either, so it's kind of up in the air that way. What I know is typically it's through an injury, you know, some part of your skin is cut open, and that's typically um, how people will get staph. Um, and treatment for it is an intense, heavy duty antibiotic. You know, some people don't need. Um, an IV um, antibiotic. Sometimes it's just a pill that you can take. Um, in my case, because it had gone undetected and it was so hard to find, um, and where it was, um, the protocol was to do six week minimum of antibiotic 24 seven through a pick line um, to make sure that it would kill absolutely any speck of infection in my body. Um, but if, you know, when people get it and it's been cut open, it's typically localized to that spot. Um, it can spread and it can move, um, but those are rare cases, so.